let's face it, Earth's gravity vector does not change. Clearly, it is something we do or stop doing with respect to gravity that makes the difference to our bodies. On Earth, over decades, from peak development on, we steadily, we steadily use gravity less and less. The less we move, the less we use gravity. The less we move, the less we use gravity. In our modern technology-rich years, we sit more, and it is killing us. Now, here's the good news. If inadequate use of gravity is indeed the cause of our health problems, then the solution is simple. All we have to do is restore its use. Ah, but how? The answer is not simple because we do not yet fully understand how the body, exactly how the body perceives the variety of ways the gravity vector stimulates it. Yes, we know about the vestibular system. We know about proprioceptors throughout the body. We have an understanding of various other systems potentially that can be affected, but exactly how, what the totality of the ways that gravity stimulates the body are not completely understood. We have much research to do yet. On Earth, gravity is our lifeline, our stimulus, our point of reference. Pulling to the center of the Earth in a head down, in a head to toe position, uh, angle, vector, it is our point of reference. It centers us and grounds us. From the moment we are born and move, the gravity vector is present to stimulate every cell, every nerve in our body to help us grow and develop so that we become what we are. It etches maps in our brain that tell us where we are in relation to our environment. These disappear in space. This, this, these disappear quite rapidly in space, even in sh on shuttle within 14 days. It gives us, gravity gives us our sense of thrilling, acceleration, and fun. Think about it. Most of the activities that you consider fun somehow or other involve gravity. We have struggled for decades to exercise more and eat less. We are fatter, sicker, more tired, and more out of pocket than ever. Some of us even exercise strenuously, yet the way we live is slowly killing us. We can't seem to stop the slippery slope. 